What's going on everybody? I go by MRCP and today I'm here with a very exciting video. I'm going to let you guys know what I've been kind of brewing up over the last couple of months and uh, talk to you guys a little bit about it. First though, I'm going to stay on a very busy street. Uh, so the cars are going to be covered. Probably you're going to be hearing cars and trucks and motorcycles probably the whole video. I apologize. I'm also recording this on my phone. So the audio is not going to be great, but bear with me. Secondly, it's my son's birthday today. Um, I want to wish him a happy birthday, let him know that I miss him. And uh, so let's get into the video. So a little, little backstory is I've been doing a lot of vending, little uh, vending sessions this summer. And it's been, I've been enjoying it. It's, I just had a grill and a table. You know, you gotta get your permits and things like that. But uh, um, it's been, like I said, it's been pretty, pretty fun for me. Uh, so I went ahead and pulled the trigger something that I've always kind of wanted to do in June and I bought a food cart or trailer however you want to look at it for uh, from my uh, Ben's carts which uh, it's been a very pleasant experience up to this point with Ben's carts so I ordered it in June and it was here July 22nd and I just went and picked it up about a week ago and, uh, it's supposed to rain this weekend so I'm gonna be pushing it into a garage just wanted to get this video done before I did that. Now a couple things. The cart comes with a white plastic film on it. It's protected against minor scratches things during shipping. I have not cleaned the cart up. I have not got it all, you know, ready to go yet, but we're gonna turn you guys around and let you guys check out. Alright, there is the cart. As I said, the white stuff on the bottom and you'll see it around the cart as we go. It's just a plastic film and it gets ripped off like that you just rip it off and and uh, the whole cart is stainless steel but I went ahead a couple little things that I added on the third wheel I think it's gonna make it easier to push it into spots once you take it off the back of your truck or car uh, I also added the grill and this is and this particular cart is the cash cow cart um, so yeah, I love the way the grill is mounted on the side because on this car, I'm going to be doing, to start with, just going to be doing hot dogs, chili dogs, you know, hot dogs with chili cheese and nachos, just simple to get started. So this is where, you know, your steam tables are. I did add an extra, an extra uh, steam table um, and then the sinks and stuff are included with the cart, but you don't, you can, you can configure them any way you want to if you want one sink if you want three sinks if you want four sinks you can do that the way you want to i went with three and uh, let's see here right here is the the cooler which actually comes with your paperwork and that box with your, your tail lights and and screws in it that you need the grill has a setup I, I think the grill where it's at it's perfect because you're gonna be grabbing you know hot dogs or whatever in here throw them on the grill it just to me it seems very convenient where everything is placed but I have not put this in action yet so so when I do actually get it in action I'll let you guys know my my thoughts on it here's the bread the bread box which another option I added was the um, hot water on demand and that's where the hot water heater would be over here, just extra room. A lot of, a lot of plastic. I still got to get out and clean it up. All right, walking around to the side of the cart. Got your little door there. That's where your two propane tanks would be. One will go straight to the grill. The other one goes into your your hot water tank and your in your. All right, your steam tables and things like that. On this side, we have the fresh water tank. And right there on the side, there's the battery for the hot water. Uh, the hot water pump and the hot water pump is right there. It just has a switch. Once it's all, you know, uh, ready to go, you just turn on the switch and you have water coming to your sinks. So, yeah, so I already got a... Uh, I already got a couple, couple spots that I that they you know, let me know I can be there whenever I want. There is one more 
uh, I gotta get, have the health department come out and check out the cart and do their thing. Um, and that's supposed to be happening hopefully next week. They won't give me exact time with COVID. As you said, anywhere between, I think, four to six weeks or something like that, which you know, we'll, have to, we'll have to see. I called and kind of see how the line was. And the lady told me there's probably, probably be next week. So I am hoping for that. And to put this, to put this thing together, trust me, to put things together, I thought I was gonna have trouble, I thought I was gonna need some help. Everything, the lights, the wires are color coded, and they, they give you everything you need. You just slip it over the wires, you got your lights plugged in. Very simple. The grill, there's only one spot. Pretty much, there's, there's one spot for everything. So if you just look, you know that the grill goes right there. It has the screw holes in it. And it took me maybe 20 minutes with the drill just to drill the stuff together. And uh, I honestly can't wait to, um, this weekend, I'm gonna be going over to uh, to my brothers and we're gonna have some friends over and we're gonna, I'm gonna test out some dirty water dogs. I'm gonna try to see what will be the best way, the best route, you know. Because I do like a grilled dog, but I know it's, it's more prep. So we're gonna see what would be the best way if I want to steam and then grill. Or if I just want to be steamed, we'll see. I'll let you guys know. We'll, I'll get some videos up in action if you guys are interested in that. And we'll see how. I'm sure there's gonna be some adjustments. You know, it's, it's a learning process when you get a you get a setup like that. But I'm excited for it because why not? <laughs> I appreciate you guys for watching today. And uh, if you guys want to see more stuff like this, let me know. If you have any questions about the cart, like I said, as of this video, I haven't actually used it yet. But if you have any questions about my experience with the shipping or anything like that, just let me know. And I will do my darndest to answer them. Appreciate you guys for watching. See you guys in the next one.